Well, the bitter cold of the last few days is gone. A problem remains for the city's animal care and control. People not caring for their pets, leaving them in the cold, and sometimes with deadly results. Our story tonight from RTB6 reporter Chris Prophet. The snow and cold that paralyzed central Indiana also contributed to the deaths of two dogs whose owners now face possible criminal charges. They weren't just isolated cases either. Animal control officials say it's part of a widespread problem. Animal care and control officer Austin Webb is going on a familiar run, one his department made 90 times on Tuesday alone. It's uh, to neglect, um, it says a dog left outside. Animals left chained or to wander in brutal cold. I know there have been some dogs brought in that have had frostbite on their paws. Um, and they can get it just as easily as we can. I'm a little surprised that people aren't taking better care of their animals. The city's animal shelter has taken in some of the dogs left outside by their owners. However, officers say that when confronted, most people do oblige and take their dogs indoors. Animals uh, suffer the same type of injuries as we do, and we don't want to be out in the weather, and they shouldn't be either, and people should take proactive measures to protect their pets instead of having animal care and control dictate to them uh, what they need to do. Animal control calls it extreme neglect. Dogs left in sub-zero cold, two dead so far that officers know of. On this call, the address wasn't found after someone concerned about a dog left outside called the Mayor's Action Center. While the extreme cold is over, Animal Care and Control hopes to send a message to dog and cat owners that they are responsible for their pet's well-being. Chris Profit, RTV6. And Animal Care and Control officers can issue tickets to pet owners who leave their dogs and cats outside. Prosecutors are looking into possible charges against the owners of the two dogs that died in the cold.